There we go. There we go. Computer lagged for a moment there when I hit start recording. How's that disk space look? Anyways, what's up everybody? This is Andy. We're back with another game of NCAA Football 2007. It's the Fresno State Coronavirus Dynasty. Entertaining you, but more importantly myself, during this time of lockdown. I'm very lucky that I can work from home and also take breaks as I please, as long as I you know do the work that I'm supposed to do every day. And so we're just here to enjoy breaking up the day with the game of NCAA. And we're running a uh, dynasty with Fresno State at the request of my buddies. We all went to Fresno State. They said, oh man, there's no sports right now. What do we do? Well, we got to get Andy to uh, run a dynasty and record it and stream it and interact with folks as he does so. So we're in season two, huge game. Uh, this is definitely the biggest game in a while. You can see the beginning of the season was a bit front loaded. We squeaked one out against Texas A&M. We were actually up by 17 in the fourth quarter. They scored a couple late. Uh, handled Kansas State, got bumped up by Oregon. And then since then, we've been rolling pretty well. But now we're toward the end of the season. This is our biggest, this is the biggest, the biggest game in a while. I mean, this is gonna define how the season goes if we're second place or more like or first place. I mean, we're going against Boise. I think they're also undefeated in conference. So let's check on that real quick. We do also have some, uh, Prospects visiting, so that's important as well. Uh, we don't have eyes to watch. Where are we at? Conference standings. Yeah, Boise's five and zero. So this is for the. This is basically for the for the WAC. We came up short last year. We got second in the WAC. We also lost to Boise. So this is a revenge game, and it's for first place in the WAC. So one thing I'm nervous about is if you watched the last game you may have seen Marcus Riley break his jaw and be out for eight weeks so because of that I'm looking for someone to step up in his place so my what I ended up doing was switching from a 4-3 to a 3-4 and putting uh, Malik Jackson who's I believe my next best or he, he's my best non and the video is gonna go out for a second forgive he is my best reserve defensive player so I want to get him on the field and so to do that I'm putting him at outside linebacker and moving Chris Carter to inside linebacker so now we have so three four you have two middle linebackers so that is that those are going to be uh, it's going to be Chris Carter and uh, Ben Jacobs and then the other linebacker we have Kadir Brown So, so that is it. And actually, who, who was my outside linebacker before? Because I think I have that, right? Kadir Brown, Hygel Lane. I mean, Kadir Brown has been playing, right? Three, 13 tackles. Or is it? It's not been Hygel Lane, has it? No, no, no. Yeah, so we got uh, Jacobs, Chris Carter. And we got, uh, yeah, we're going to have Malik Jackson on the other side. And Marcus Riley, if we make a good enough bowl game, a.k.a. is it in January, we actually have a chance to uh, to get him back for the very last game. Actually, if you'll pardon, I'll be back in five seconds. So let's get to it. I mean, honestly, part of the reason I'm stalling here a little bit is because I am nervous about this game. This is the biggest game. It's the biggest game of the season so far. I mean, I, my mentality is I'm all about winning conference. Win your conference. That's always priority one. So realistically, uh, to me, this is more important than the game against uh, Texas A&M or against Oregon. I mean, those are important for rankings. But I don't know. I just always feel like got to win your conference. Got to get number one. That's the idea. So as we reviewed last time, we are a little bit lucky on suspensions and injuries for Boise, as they are with us. I mean, I have my, probably the best player on the team is out, Marcus Riley. So we, we have a few guys out for them as well, a couple of offensive linemen, and I think their top DB is out, Skandrick. Oh, this is a big one, guys. Oh, I didn't change. Okay, hold on, hold on. I didn't change my, my defensive playbook. We're going to back out. We're going to back out. You know, I don't care. It's no, no, no. I didn't get my playbook. Look at the wind. No, sorry, guys. Sorry. False start. False start. 
forgot to set the fourth, uh, the three four playbook. Okay. Defense playbook three four. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. Man, that wind. Also, that that wind would have made the game fun. Hey, I called it. I called it way before the wind came in. No. All right. So let's go. Here we go. I really don't like that I had to restart, but I'm sorry. I had to, I had to get my proper playbook. Clear skies and just beautiful weather here for tonight's game. Okay, lighter wind, more reasonable. And the Bulldogs of Fresno State. Man, I'm 21. We're 21 in the country. I really... We have a few games left. I feel like if I keep winning big, we might be able to get that January bowl game. I don't know. I don't know. Somehow UNLV has to lose, though. UNLV has to lose, and also we have to jump Utah, who's also ranked ahead of us. Oh, I'll switch over to chat. i got to see the chat. Hey, hey, what's up, Audrey Potamus? Oh, yeah. Oh, you didn't see that? Yeah, dude, he's out for eight weeks. Did they beat the number one? I didn't see that. So I'm putting Malik Jackson. It's basically, James, just a way to get – I don't know if James – I don't know if you can hear or not, James. It's a way to get Malik Jackson on the field. And probably, I mean, I, I run so much nickel anyway, I don't think it'll make a huge difference. Oh, this makes me nervous. We'll take the ball. We'll take the ball. We've been playing better on offense. So this is just for James. Just highlighting what we're doing here. Nope, oh, damn it. Didn't mean to do that. I was just trying to flicker on and off. We're getting Lee Jackson at rush end. That's what we're doing. It was the best way I could figure out. And James, you might have better you might have better ideas. We we're on a conference call, so I'm left to my own devices. Let's go, Lanye. Miller fields it at the seven. Ooh. All right, this is risky because if I uh, I don't know, it, it makes me nervous. Okay, let's let's just try let's try the big the two tight end set QB slot. We'll just try it since we're on the far side. Okay, they do have Tadman back there at safety. So here we're going to try to get somebody to jump or look for someone to wiggle. Left side. Ooh, oh, big, 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 big. Let's go. This is how you start a game. Let's go, Clifton. Woo! Oh, man. Oh, man. Now, one thing you'll notice is I don't get full momentum for that. I knew I wouldn't. But look at that. Boise's D's look a little slow, man. They're looking a little slow. They're looking a little slow out there, a little sluggish. Whew. Like I said, yes, it, it makes me a little nervous because I don't get full momentum for that. But, of course, we're going to take a touchdown to start the game. Oh, man. Let's look at the replay. Is this, do the guys not react? What is it? So pretty much everybody picked up blocks. Look, even Tadman. Tadman gets frozen. He just stands there. He just eats a block from my offensive tackle. That's my tackle, right? Yeah, my tackle just, just gets out there. Everybody gets blocked. And Clifton is fast enough to get past him. Wowzus. Wowzus. Is this even – is this Heisman, guys? I'm playing on Heisman, right? I'll be freaking – I'll be beside myself if I'm not. Yeah, it's on Heisman. Default sliders, man. I guess I'm just – man, oh, man. I'm not, I must be getting better at the game, too. I mean, I don't want to, like – give myself all the credit in the world, but I, I am playing better than I did last season. I mean, last season, let's be honest, Hawaii probably doesn't happen this season the way I'm playing. So let's start with it. Let's, uh, we just want to get Malik, uh, Malik Jackson rushing. So let's do it. It's the cover three. The only thing you don't have, and this is actually okay, but you don't have Malik Jackson with the ability to jump the snap because he's not down. He's actually he's standing up. So that's one thing we don't get. But I've tried several times with him this year to get the great jump, and it wasn't happening. Our linebackers, look how bad they look. Oh, God, that's bad. Okay. I'll play up with Edwards and see if I can snipe a pick. 
Oh, we got, oh, I jumped the snap, but in a place where it didn't matter. Okay, we can get off the field here. Let's go with the bunch. There's like a four, four, uh, three, four bunch up here. We'll go with this cover three cloud. Okay, this is actually kind of nice because you're, uh, the corner sits, he sits down. He stays, his, he stays shallow. Oh, we got this, we got this. Let's go, let's go. They really had nothing going on that run. Ian Johnson. It's like you do Ian Johnson. You already got you already uh you already got the storybook. Two point conversion to win uh to win the Fiesta Bowl proposal on TV. You don't need you don't need that extra road win at Fresno State. You don't need it. You don't need it. Okay, let's go. Let's go, Wiley. I don't know if I can get anything going here. This is a fair catch. We had a guy coming in hot. So something I want to look at here. Let's go. Let's go right to it, man. Let's go right to it. Tight end slot, and we're going with I think QB slot option. Where other side? Yeah, there we go. So we're we're going right to it. We gotta try this out. Oh, this is interesting. They spread out. This this is good because I like to run up the middle on this anyway. We'll do a two count. Oh, okay. Great jump. Who blew up? Blown up. Left side got blown up. Yeah, blocking actually wasn't too bad. Okay, I, I mean, on the, if, if that guy doesn't get blown up on the left. But I think that end is still getting me. So let's check this out. Okay, Tadman's on the right side. Let's go with, uh, let's go short drags. This is all left. This is all left. We're looking for Saccone or Devin Wiley getting loose. We'll go ahead and block Clifton. Because we just don't want to throw over the middle, like directly over the middle. Here we go. Oh no! That was close. Wiley got bumped. I actually had man. I had Sacone in man, but look at this. I'm looking at Wiley. I'm looking at Wiley. I'm like, oh, he's coming free. He's coming free. Watch. He's coming free. He's coming free. He's coming free. Boom. Right as I throw it. Look, this dude could easily have broken over. Easily. God, that was close. Okay. Third and three. So here's what I want to do here because I like this play. It's a little risky because it does require blocking, but I want to run PA read here. Okay, we got some bunch up action. This is good. This is kind of a read on the left. I'll have to see what that, that left edge linebacker does. He went in. Go, 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 go. Man. So did I misread or let's just, let's look at this real quick. So what I saw, I saw this guy going in. So I'm like, okay, I have a chance. Oh, uh, we have these two guys coming in. So our guard, and this is issue too. This is plat. Now keep in mind, yeah, this is pass blocking by the O-line. So that's an issue. So actually, if I, well, I can't say if I held on, I'd be able to hit save because these guys react pretty well. So they're basically flocking probably in large part because I did hand it off. So if I keep it, save is probably not open. Or I mean, it's hard to say. It's hard to say, but it's okay. Hey, it's okay. We got them on three out, three and out last time. Uh, we'll do sky punt. Fourth and two, Fresno State lining up the punt. And also keep in mind, we don't have momentum yet. We did get that early touchdown. So we'll go down a touch. There we go. So we'll stick with cover three with Malik Jackson rushing in. And also, I need to check some replays and just see how he's doing. Because I really haven't paid attention to if he's, get, if he's been getting off blocks or anything like that. Okay, we got kind of lucky there. How did he do there? Uh, he held up okay against the receiver, though. Hmm. I might do a manual control on him just to see. Yeah, we could try. What do you mean room on the last punt, though? Counter. Let's get out there. There we go. Okay. Third down again. Let's get the stop. Okay, they're in nickel. Okay, let's do... Let's, let's bring out some... Uh, We'll bring out the pass D. Here's a third and three. Ball on the yeah, and as much as we love Malik Jackson, the simple fact is he doesn't get snap jumps like that. The defense sets up in the nickel. Boom. Oh, no. Oh, I did jump the snap, but it was on the wrong side. Oh, oh yeah. I don't, I don't know if you can fake snap on a punt, though. Oh, oh, right, right. Get in. The one time I go in goal line. Yeah, I'll have to check that out. That's a good point. I forgot about that. It's risky though because like if you snap it and they they get back in time, ugh, you know that's what I don't want. 
And they're, they're committed to the run. They're also not mixing up their snap count, so I'm going to have to... Uh, I'm going to have to try to jump the snap, I think. And I would like to do it with Roberts, too, to free up Malik Jackson to try to get in. Oh, I didn't get a jump. Oh, no. Get off, get off, get off. That's bad. Okay, get, go, go. Get him. Yikes. That was, that was iffy. Because, look, there's after this, there's no there's nobody, man. I mean, if he breaks that sooner, that's probably a touchdown. Okay, let's throw off. Let's, let's switch up the alignment a little bit. We'll go back to cover three. I also really don't want to blitz. Really anti-blitz right now. Okay. Oh wow. Oh man, for like four yards. Okay, let's go to the one where they're pinched middle. Actually, we want to rush Jack. Well, I don't know what I'm doing here. Wiggins, I don't know. In the game, I don't know that he's in here. Okay, let's go cover three in here. If they don't snap it, I'm going to rush. I'm going to try to jump. Okay, here we go. I like this, though, because I can cheat up with the DB. Okay. Oh, we got him. We got him. Yes. Yes. Okay. They're punting. That's good. How did that go? How did that? He, so the QB just didn't drop back very far, and he got a little antsy. He could have run for it easily, but he was kind of already locked into his passing animation. Oh, man. That was, that was, that was clutch. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I actually have Wiggins in on the team in this game. I think... Uh, I don't know. I'll have to check on that, though. Okay, that's a fair catch. Get out of the way. Yikes. That was almost iffy. They had the ball before? Exactly. Okay. So let's check this out. We got... Let's look, we're going to look for the swing pass or say coming across. Uh, or we'll just run it because I don't want to throw a pick. Okay, he was offsides. Excellent, excellent. So let's see if we had Clifton. Uh, kinda, kinda. I mean, these guys are in zones. So they're going to come up pretty quickly, but that's probably five yards. That's that's probably five if I uh, if I hand it off. Let's do. Let's try some QB slot. We have a little bit of momentum. Just enough. Just enough, and we kind of have them overmatched. Like their D's not that that good. We match up super well. Comes out in the shotgun. Right no, no, no. Oh, darn. Okay, at least we got the edge. That's good. Like, what happened here, though? I was hoping that Bear would block. He did not. He did not. Because I wanted to go, like, and run another long one. Uh, yeah, I don't have, I don't have, we don't have Kenny Wiggins, I don't think. Yeah, he's not in here. He's a tackle, I believe, right? Yeah, so I didn't. I guess I didn't put him in. Okay, let's check out split and drag. So here, so this is what we got. We got Sacone coming in as primary read. Otherwise, go deep to say. Otherwise, swing to Clifton. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Nice. And look, this is clutch. This is key. This is key right here. Wait for him to get upfield. If I throw it here, he's going out of bounds. I, the blocking is good enough, which I'm very thankful for. Blocking is good enough. I'm able to wait for him to cut upfield. Now, did I have uh, did I have C? Not really. No, I did not at all, actually. Bear, bear a little bit, but that's against a dot, so we don't want that. We did have uh, we we had Dorsey running deep, so that's a possibility. Let's look at the speed on their DBs. 91, 87, 86. Like, we match up basically the same. We really don't have any advantage there. Safeties, we kind of have a speed advantage on that guy. Tadman, he's a dot, so speed kind of doesn't matter. He'll be he'll be fast. Okay, let's look at corner sit. Ooh, they're bunched up. This actually looks pretty tasty for the swing pass. They'll work from the shotgun. 
Ooh, ooh. <gasps> We're gonna box him out. Oh, got it! OPI? OPI. I got OPI. Dang it. It was a good pass. It was pretty short. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, first and 25. Dang it. Okay, so I think this is man, though. Yeah, so so Clifton's not open. Just not that good of a pass. Did I throw it too early? No, not really. This was super underthrown. Gosh darn it. Okay, so we don't... Let's go WR Corners. So it's kind of a similar thing to the other play. We're looking for Sei, Saccone. Don't get fooled by that safety coming in. It's Sei and then Saccone and then, and then Clifton. Okay, here we go. Coming across. Oh, no. Oh, what? I didn't hit X. Or apparently I did. I hit, meant to hit Y. Okay, we've got to get, like, we've got to get some yardage here. We, we can't screw around. Okay, we do. Okay, we have Clifton in the zone. So let's do this. Let's get go PA read. They might suspect. Okay, they're bunched up. Let's see how they shift. They pinch in. Linebacker out. So I really need to go for the swing pass here. Swing pass. Uh, here we go. Here we go. We're just going for it. Oh, no. He couldn't even break one tackle. Yikes. Okay. Say he would have come free over here. He would have come free. So now, yikes. Now we basically have to look for WR corners where we get a corner and a post. That's our only hope. Split and drag. Yikes. I just don't like. Yeah, we'll go split and drag. So here, here's what we'll do. We basically don't want to throw at Tadman. Oh, and Bear's out there. Oh. We'll leave Bear out there because he's he's big. Yeah, that wasn't happening. I mean, I, I guess I could have gone for Bear. I just I have such reservations about throwing at Bear because he's so slow. Yeah, Bear was open though. He was open. If I go high bullet to Bear, it's probably completed. Yeah, that's too bad. <laughs> yeah, it, it can be it can be uh, a little deceptive. I personally don't feel like I have an issue with it, but that's not to say I don't. Let's just try to rush in with Malik. Okay, that's good. Maybe I should do more user control because look how easily he gets in there. And actually, if I cut in quicker, I could have I could have really got him. I could have got him faster. This actually could be pretty advantageous. Boise State comes out with an eye formation. No, 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 no. Okay, we got him at least. That was the first though. That was a pretty good run. Okay, let's go like just let's just change it up. Change up the, the D lineman. To see if we can mess up their blocking a bit. We'll cheat up too. We'll cheat up with the safety. Ooh. Oh man, I was, ooh, nice. That was clutch, Ben Jacobs. Wow. Because I was standing there, but I didn't didn't react. Mm-hmm. Wait, so was he getting rushed or anything? No, he was not. He just did a quick draw back. We'll run it again. You know what this could also be good for? I think this would be a good time to try to bait a deep pass. Okay, they don't go for it. They don't take the bait. We got third and six. Now this this smacks this to me looks like they would probably go for a deep pass here. I might be able to bait them. Okay, we're gonna play the flat with Kadir Brown instead. Oh, they go for the pass. They go for the run. That wasn't even a handoff. Oh wow. Fake handoff, or I don't know if that's a botched animation. That that looks like an animation that I get sometimes, where I try to hand it off, but the QB doesn't do it. Wow, that guy can sure scoot. He looked pretty slippery there. What is his speed? 
56. So of course, of course he's mega slippery and just whisked his way upfield with the greatest of ease. Of course, of course. Boise State lining up the punt. Number 18 will be the return man. Okay, we'll cover this fullback. Just don't want to get faked on. Okay. Yeah, this is a fair catch. All right. The offense comes back on the field, hoping to build off their last drive. They had something going, but okay, let's go. Okay, I want to do this. I just want to try this one more time. Actually, let's go tight end slot again. I want to run QB slot option. Just see what they come out in. If they, if they keep coming out with all these linebackers, we might jump out of it. Okay, they're in nickel. They're in nickel. They pinch in. Bring Bear up. Ooh, not bad. Not okay. I don't like getting leveled like that. That's that's good blocking. Look at the blocking. Look at the push. And I could have gone this way. Could have gone up the middle. Would have been a little riskier. I like following that block. That's nice. Okay. Here's what we might do because we scored a touchdown on it. Let us put in some speed and try a QB slot option again. Okay. They're in zones. They have a corner sitting out there. Doesn't look as good, but if we get a push, oh, it's Clifton. I thought it was going to be Ryan Matthews. That's okay. <gasps> there we go. There we go. Ooh. Stiff arm? Yeah, fall forward. Let's go. Maybe we should run this play more. Already over 100 yards. Okay, let's go QB choice, see what we get. I mean, they're, I'm really getting them with these, uh, these off-tackle shotgun runs. That's what I call a playmaker, the Bulldog. Come out the shotgun. Ooh, okay, I didn't right I didn't try to do the snap count too much there. So that's my fault. Okay, let's have a look at some split end drag. Yeah, let's look at have a look at some split end drag. Okay, on this play, I need to let Clifton run his route because I need that extra option. with three wide receivers. Here we go. Oh, okay. That's okay. That's okay. Because if I throw it sooner, I had to wait. I had to wait to throw this because I was going to Clifton. I basically had to wait so that, to get it, let him get up field, but it just wasn't. There wasn't enough time. So third and long yet again. Let's do this. Let's do halfback angle and hope that Clifton. We're looking for Say on the corner. We got to hope that Pasco and Clifton hold uh, Tadman back from C. Nope, nope, but look at this. Look at this. Oh, not enough. And he dropped it. Yeah, that's right. And you, you might still be on mute, uh, James. But yeah, that's basically what I said. I had to wait. That's why I ended up getting hit. So here, this is kind of interesting. We got one guy guarding two over here, although he can easily come over and guard the pass, so Sacone is by no means open. Hmm. Okay, okay. The punter comes on the field, getting ready to send one off. Number 19 is the deep man awaiting the return. He gets it off. Number 19 fields at the 29. The defense did a good job against him the last time they had the ball, forcing the punt. Okay, I'm going to try to rush in with Malik Jackson some more. They might not be so lucky this time. The Bulldogs come out in a 34 defense. Johnson sweeps left. Gets past the oh, tackle. And he's tackled at the 35. He gets maybe two yards on the toss. Okay, let's do a little movement on the line. Mess up their blocking. Their own 35 -yard line. Second and eight. God, this is nerve-wracking. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Oh, and this guy took a bad angle. Dang it. The, the, the whole time, I'm mashing the heck out of the B button. Oh my gosh. Here's, here's what I see, and this is why I got so upset. I'll show you what I'm seeing. Who? Let's let's us go. Dude, uh, well, I'm trying to restrain myself from swearing, but I'll show you what I'm seeing. So, okay, look, I'm controlling Malik Jackson. Okay, he's out of the play. Switch off. They give me the guy who just got his tackle broken. Useless. Now who we got? The guy that's getting absorbed in a block. 
useless. Now who we got? The whole time, I'm like, just give me Simmons. Give me Simmons so I can run at like a freaking, what do you call that? Like a 80-degree angle. Just let me, I want to tackle Ian Johnson like right here. So I'm like, give me Simmons. Give me Simmons. Nope. Who do we switch back to? Probably someone else useless. Yep. Someone who's getting clipped, shoved in the back. Now who, now, then, then, then who do they give me from there? Okay. So it's like, okay, no, you don't want, you don't, you, must, okay. Our mistake. You didn't want Jenkins. Who's completely out of the play. You must've wanted Jake Jordy. Who's lying flat on his stomach. Oh, pardon me. You didn't want Jake Jordy. Maybe you want Ben Jacobs who has less speed than Ian Johnson and is behind him. Then when it's far too late and the guy's already getting freaking blocked because if you give him to me here, I'm, I'm down here already. But because you took your time moving in this way, he gets chipped and he's out of the play too. So just nothing. No, no. No love on the switch. Look who has momentum too. Gosh darn it. See if we can block this. I'm upset. Okay, we might have to, I, I don't know. I mean, it's been kind of feast or famine. I've been getting big plays, but not consistently getting yardage. So I might run a run. I'm thinking about coming out and running, uh, running the short drags because it has that corner out. I think I might start with that. That's not Riley anymore, dude. It's a sad day. Yeah, so let's run short drags because we get that corner out. Okay, we're gonna block Clifton. This is a little bit feast or famine, but I think we can we can try to get. We just gotta get Wiley, and I'm also if it's zone, I might force it to Sacone. Nope, uh, nobody's open. Nobody's open. Nobody's open. So I saw zone. I really want to get Wiley. This guy's chase though. If it's not a good pass, it's a pick six. I said I would force it to Sacone in a zone, but no, I was kind of getting rushed as well, so I ran away from the play. Mm hmm okay let's do this so we haven't done too much of this let's look for normal we're gonna go here we're gonna go PA read flow okay they come out with a bunch in the box okay oh look this is man so we can kind of game this a bit we're gonna block Clifton we're going to send Sacone deep we're gonna send say on and out so hopefully we can hit say on this out okay freaking hell ah Dude, just, they, how does it, there's just nobody over here. Okay, they did have a guy, but he bit on the non-existent play action. And apparently so did I. Well, yeah, but I mean, I don't know that, that's true, but I don't know that he telepathically is going to sit on the route. You know, so I wouldn't call that bad play design or bad, bad play anticipation. Oh, goodness. Okay, let's try slot wheel. I mean, we're just kind of grasping at straws here. We have to hope that they th give us a man look deep. I mean, I could force it to Dorsey here. That's on Tadman, though. So more likely I'm forcing a say. Actually, let's do this. Let's see what let's see what Tadman does. We might even throw the wheel, which Jared has been asking for all, all, all season. He steps up. He guns it. Didn't jump. Could have gone to Say. Say probably would have been a better choice. God, just why? Why didn't he jump? Say was kind of open here. Let's see. Where does? Where's Dorsey when I throw it? Dorsey. Yeah, I don't want to throw it at, at Tadman. I should have forced the corner. I had it sooner. You think so? You might be right. Like if I throw it there. Well, he has to get past these guys though. So when do I throw it? Do I throw it? Yeah. I mean, I pretty much. I wait like a half a second. I really don't throw it that late. Because if I throw it here, this guy, like if I start throwing it now, this guy's going to, gonna, he's going to hustle back. Yeah, maybe. No! Son of a bird. Okay, at least we got him with the uh, flag. Oh.
Really? This is this is the fumble, fumble Ruski. He kicks the ball. He kicks the ball forward. That's not allowed. That's not allowed. And of course, all these a hey, jerk offs just freaking these jerks just run like up. No, oh my god. Is this really how this game is going, guys? Is this really how this game is going to go? I'm, I'm open to suggestions. Do I need to run the ball more? Maybe, you know what? I'm going back to the big uh, two tight end set to run it more because it kind of did. I mean, well, the thing, the thing I didn't like and I said it immediately is I don't get momentum for that. Of course, of course, of course, of course. Yep, uh-huh. Yep, this is how it's going. Goodness. So let's do this. Let's try to, we're going to try to game it a bit. Uh, where's Nickel? There's Nickel. Yeah, we're, this is, this is how we're, how we're doing. Cover two, we'll go cover three. It's like all jacked up though. It's a jacked up cover three. They're probably running the ball. Yep. Oh my God! Of course, they get an eight-yard fall forward. Yeah, we can try. I'll, I'll look at it at halftime. Okay, so we're gonna go. We'll go with the four, uh, three, four. We'll just call an all-out all out blitz. And actually, let's stick with this, because like if if they pass it here, in theory, we sh they should be throwing it to someone in man coverage. And if it's a bad pass, we could pick it. And we just need to try different stuff here. Okay, let's get outside. Yeah, no, I agree. It's true. So, Thunder Green. Yeah, I just got to try to not let the dam break. Uh, we'll go cover three. They have some wide outs. Let's, let's man up here that we can support run as well. And then we'll just get over to the sideline if it's a pass. Oh, get... Okay, good. Good plant. Good plant. <laughs> okay. Okay, 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 okay. We got a chance. So, we're going to keep calling Thunder Green. I'm going to go back to cover three. Okay, there we go. We're cheating hardcore. It's a pass. It's a pass. Get over there. Nope. I, I banned my, my zone. I bit. I bit. I bit. I did bite. Yeah, let's see who's rushing in over there. Uh, it's going to be whoever's in Riley's spot. I think that was right outside, so that's Kadir Brown. So the problem with this is Riley is a dot, and you're not going to get faster than that. I could do formation subs. Let's try formation subs. Uh, let's see. Return, safety kick return. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can change formation subs on the... Uh, Dude, uh, there's nobody's gonna get there. He does, nobody else has a dot. Like I'd have to put Clifton there, honestly. I'd have to, I can watch. I'll sub in Clifton right now and see what happens. Just for the moment, we'll take out Kadir Brown. Does Clifton is even make the top? Yeah, here he is. We'll put Clifton in there. And they line up for the point after. Oh, he got, he almost got there. I mean, do we need to do that every time? <laughs> do we need to do that every time though? He almost got there. God, this is, don't let, you gotta, you guys gotta keep me, you guys gotta, you guys gotta keep me from uh, getting delirious, okay? I can't go on tilt. Look, he got in there, but the fact is, nobody else, it doesn't matter the acceleration, you have to have a dot. Okay, so we're gonna do this. We're going back to our big set. We're putting in uh, Ryan Matthews. Okay, this is a good alignment. They're in man, which means they don't have anybody on the outside. No corner sitting there. Okay, we got to get somebody wiggle on the left side of the line. Somebody did wiggle. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. We'll get some yardage. Gosh darn, dude, look at the momentum. Their guys are just pursuing. I'm getting no kind of, uh, no corner. We're around the same play, half these guys. Okay, this is another good alignment. Fresno State lines up in a shotgun set. 
I saw a guy move. Okay, here we go. Here we go. This actually could be a touchdown. Get the corner. Get the corner. Get the corner. Let's go right. Right. Okay. I, I just because I, I want to torture myself. I want to see what speed 29 has. Because we get into a full-on just sprint. Also, I'm moving a little faster than him. I'm going to say he has 84 speed. 29. Show me. Show me 84 speed on 29. 82 speed. And he catches me from behind. Now, he wasn't running faster than me, but, dude, that, he did not, he should not have had that angle. No, it really is. I mean, they're putting out like they're in dime now. Now I need to be careful. Tadman is flashing. Someone move. We'll do a two count. Ooh, got lucky there. Okay. Oh man. See, look at look at their pursuit. Their pursuit. They're faster. Their pursuit is so good right now. Okay. Let's look at. Uh, let's look at a little pass play. Where's my corner? Where's corner sit? It'll run corner sit. Now I just have to. I be. I gotta be careful with Tatman. But this is where I would force it deep to see right here. Oh, those DBs are green though. Okay, we're just gonna take some yardage. Oh, gotta be careful. Wow, I got so lucky I didn't get hit there. Okay, we got two yards. Okay, at least we can get a... Uh, okay, okay, let's run those WR corners. Because we either have Dorsey coming across. Okay, this might be zone, so I don't want to get fooled by those safeties creeping up. Here we go, here we go, here we go. What? How am I screwing up the user so badly? Like, I must just not have been even close. Well, yeah, that's a problem. I was nowhere near. The pass was so f far ahead, I wasn't going to get there. Because I tried to go into the animation. Or I do too early. I don't know. Or I do too early. But we can at least get three here. It really is, man. This is, you're getting the full, you're getting the full Monty right here if you're watching this game. Uh, Wiley... So I, I normally don't do it on corners, but it is possible. It's more of a post. Oh, I also got hit on the throw. Well, I was pressured, I should say. It has the distance. Yikes, didn't make that by much. Thank goodness, though. We needed that badly. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I just, I'm so shell-shocked. I really don't want to force it into coverage, but yeah. I'm going to have to at some point, the way this game's going. Number 19 feels it in the end zone. Just get a body on him. My God. Okay. So let's go 3-4. We'll go with a bunch up. Actually, I might even switch to nickel and just start cheating up with the DBs because my run D is not that hot right now. Oh, this is good, actually. I like this. Okay, okay. I like this cover three because my DB is sitting shallow, which gives me pick opportunities. That's such crap. That is such freaking garbage. Dude, I hate this. Look at this. Fall, well, first off, I wasn't even looking at the QB, so this is ridiculous on its own. He does the old Eli Manny, and I have, like, you know, like, my last breath is behind the line of scrimmage. He throws the ball backwards, it goes forwards, and it's to a warping Ian Johnson. Because, look, I'm guarded. So, of course, he's not going to throw it to me, because this is another tenant. This is another solid, solid pillar of Heisman football, of Heisman NCAA is that their QB thrown to an open guy, It's it's it goes away from the defender. Because, look, even if I stay on the spot, it's like going way behind me. And it's for a first down. Lordy. Okay, it's nickel time. We're doing nickel cover three. We've got to abandon that three, four. It's not that bad, but it's just it's getting – there's too many ways that it's losing right now. Okay, we're going to shift the D-line. Okay, good D. Good D. Get here, Brown. We need these stops. Well, Tadman, Tadman is never committed. I mean, that's one thing of defense about defense in NCAs. You're never committed. You can always go to any side you want. Unfortunately, okay. Actually, I'm worried about that side running. Oh my God. Okay. Finally, thank goodness he dropped that. Okay, we'll go Ben Jacobs. We'll go. Oh no, fire! No, 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 no! I accidentally called fire three. I don't know how the playbook, the the dime playbook must be slightly different. I want to cover three. There we go. I gotta watch out for that. I don't want to waste timeouts on that second half. 
Okay, we'll play Edwards. Cheat up. The offense lines up with three wide receivers. <sighs> looking to pass. Looking. Throws, and they've got the screen. Yes. Okay, I don't really know if I have enough time to get anything going, but we'll see. We'll see, man. So, we'll go straight block. I don't know. I've never really blocked it. Uh, yeah, we can try it. If we can get a field goal, that would be incredible. Okay, they bring him in. We have a chance for return. Or not. Or spin move. Oh, 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 corner, corner, corner. Let's go. Let's go, Dino Wiley. Hoof it out. Hoof it out. Hoof it out. Let's freaking go. Woo. That's what we needed. God dang. <laughs> That's why we get the stops. That's why we get a stop and call timeout. <laughs> Let's freaking go, man. They are playing with a lot of intensity right now. Dude. You guys. What a game this is. Okay, let's stay calm. Let's stay calm, though. Let's stay composed. <laughs> Did I get momentum back? I didn't see. I'm just like, I just can't believe it. Oh, my gosh. I did get momentum back. Okay. Uh, we'll go nickel, cover three. Yeah, it looks like I'm plus one or plus a half. If there are halves, I don't know. Okay, we'll cheat up. Dude, we just, okay, can't give up anything big here. Okay, they're on the ball. That's what we expected. Okay, good, 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 good plant. So, we could even get them to punt again. I don't know if they will, though. We'll go cover three. Because here's the, the one reason I feel comfortable calling cover three here is I don't think, actually, I want to flip this. I don't think they're going to run the clock out. Or they're not going to chuck deep, pardon me, is what I meant to say. Okay, we're going to move back, though. I think they're running, actually. So we'll fan out the line to even it out. I think they're running the ball. Yeah, here we go. Stay in front, stay in front, stay in front. Okay. Boise calls timeout. So we'll go cover two, man. Put everybody back. 0 for 5 on third downs. Yeah, that sounds about right. Look at this. They got a punt. They're going for it. What kind of... Do you see this? They're going for it. So here's what I would wonder. How long was that last play? We could actually get the ball back here if we can do the same thing. There's seven seconds. That play took... That play took three seconds. Seven, six, five, four. We could potentially... If I could do that again, we can get the ball back with one second and kick a field goal. Dude, I, they, they have to be assuming, I did not know this logic was in the game, but they have to be assuming that the play will take longer than four seconds. They have to be, right? Okay, we're going for it, man. Got it, got it, got it, got it! Yes! <laughs> we did it! We did it! Dude, what are they thinking? Oh my gosh, I have never, I have never, in all my days, I, <laughs> that's crazy, dude, you couldn't have bet me a million dollars that they would have run, they would have run a play there, I just can't fathom, dude, this, the turn, man, how the turns table, how the turns table. Wowzers. Okay, let's concentrate on this field goal, though. Must be looking for the fake here because the starting defense is out there on the field. The kick is up. Not a bad kick. Three points, Kirk. Yeah, it won't. I think if it gave me the lead, it probably would have given me more momentum. Yeah, only one. I think if I got the lead, it would have evened it up or given me some. Or pardon me, I was already ahead. I think it would have given me more if I got the lead, though. And Stitzer's juiced. Dude, how how crazy. How, the, what the end of the half. That was insane. That was absolutely insane. Okay, this is about to be equally as insane. Yeah, that's a touchdown. Oh, Banks. Oh, Banks got him. Banks got him. Wow, they're just getting everything, though. Dude, this game is insane. This is out of hand. I'm sticking with nickel. 
I'm sick with nickel. Screw three four. That that experiment didn't work. Although I don't think that was any worse than uh. Well, you guys get over there. I don't think. I don't think that was any worse than uh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got Banks picking it off, running back. Woo hoo, guys, guys. Yes, let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. They're serving it up right now. You know what we gotta try to do now? Let's get the speed going outside. QB assault option. They haven't defended this properly yet, guys. And they gave me good alignment. up in the shotgun. Set him down. Oh, he didn't change ball hands. The magic change ball hand, not change ball hand. I'll stop complaining now because I've had some good things happen. I don't want to jinx it. Wowzers, guys. What a game. What a game. We're still losing, though. We're still losing. Look how they keep bunching up. Okay, Clifton's in this in the zone. What if I do this? Will they change their shift a little bit? Okay, we'll just do the handoff here. Let's just get upfield. How about it? How about set him down? Or don't, because he's a dot. I do. Well, I don't know. I'm pushing Y. I don't know. I don't know what else I need to do to swap to swap ball hands. Like, am I tapping it instead of? Do I need to hit it more forcefully? I honestly have no clue. Okay, I'm kind of looking to hand off here. There we go. Oh, we got a bump. It's okay. Ooh, took him out of the play. Took him out of the play. Let's go down. So they keep it on the ground and they get their third first down of the drive. Yeah, this is a pretty good looking drive, don't you think, Coach? Yes, sir. The I just, yeah, I have no idea, guys. I have no idea. We're working on it. 4-3. Okay, this actually is looking like the Matthews keeper, so the QB keeper. So we'll have to look at that. Actually, this is a little risky. We actually want to get rid of it. There we go. Not too bad. Really good blocking. Look at the blocking here. Look at the pocket that's set up. I mean, if I had a more of a running quarterback, I would have gone for it, maybe thrown a stiff arm, but no need for that. We can just get the same thing by pitching. P.A. Reed looking for swing pass. The line, the line is fanned out, which I don't care for. Can I go wide with that guy? I'll just have to read. I'll, I'm probably going to hand this off no matter what, actually. Okay, here we go. Ooh, oh, he slid off, but there's a guy right there. It's okay. Third and five. Okay, I just really... I, I'm running the ball because I refuse to turn it over here on an interception. I'm just not doing that. So this is a run all the way. Um, let's, you know what? Let's do the tight end slot business. Uh, where is it? QB slot. Okay, we gotta hurry up. Yeah, this is a handoff all the way. I'm not throwing no pick. We're taking the lead. Yeah, that's fine. I don't care. Hey, I got lined up for a uh, lined up for a straight on head on field goal. I don't care. That ball is not going in the air. I mean, I guess I should have thought of that ahead of time and try to get a first down on second down, but I don't care. I'm taking the lead, man. Do we get momentum? I feel like we should. Look at that. We got half momentum. Dude, I usually don't get this excited for these games. Like, I'm getting pumped up, man. My downstairs neighbor probably is like, what is going on? It must be Boise week. That's probably what she's thinking. Oh, we almost got the strip. Dude, Triple J. You meant, dude. You got to go back and... Honestly, I wouldn't I wouldn't begrudge you if you left right now and just went back to watch the first half. It's dude, this game has been insane, man. This has been a crazy one. Ooh, off the tip, off the tip, off the tip. Yes. Dude, Triple J, honest to goodness, you could just turn it off right now. Click on because my you should be able to go and watch the beginning already. On the, on the VOD. You can just watch that, man, honestly. It's, it's been a wacky one, dude. Okay, this looks like a handoff situation. Looking for someone to move. Uh, 
Ooh, ouch, ouch, ouch. Don't like that. Now, could I have run away from him? Yeah, I could have run away a little bit better. He got a pretty nice warp over, though. It, yeah. Hey, oh, it is wacky. It is wacky. So let's run corner sit. Maybe look for a. Uh, oh, you know what? I think I have Bear in there. Oh, no, I don't, actually. It's the wacky whack. This is the whack of yore where uh, Nevada beats Boise 62 to 61 in overtime. There we go. Got the first. Dude, it is full warp. Full warp ahead. As Picard, Captain Picard would say, maximum warp, engage. Okay, here we, I kind of feel like taking a shot. So we'll see. We'll see about. Actually, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna look for Dorsey and then look for Sacone. No, 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 no. Not really. Actually, we can get a few on the on the ground here. Okay, we'll take it. Oh, the ref ate it though. Sorry, ref. I hope they don't hold that against me. Did you guys see that? Ref took a little bit of a of a header there. That was the, that was the yardage guy. Sorry, bro. It's okay. For, at this point. Bulldog Stadium is still using real grass, so that shouldn't be that bad of a, of a landing. Okay, so I like... Let's look at drags. Oh, you know what? Let's go back to... I've got, got to do my due diligence here. Back of quarterback, normal. Run out of time. QB slot. We've got time for this. Yeah, we've got to do this at least one time down here. It's been such a good play this game. They haven't defended it well at all. Oh, goodness. Get out, get out, get out, get out. We got this, we got this, we got this. Hoof it out. Yeah. All right. Got the first. So here, uh, let's see. Let's run the drags play. And we got the corner going opposite side. It is tabbed inside, though. Don't care for that. So let's flip that. Fresno State. In a four wide set. So we'll block Clifton. Oh, didn't get it. It's okay. I don't want to burn a timeout. Darn it. That's my fault, though. That's my fault. But it's okay. We, we got our first down. Actually, I'll run the same play because I'm looking to go end zone. So it won't matter. The five yards actually gives me a little bit more room. So we're looking at everything left, either Wiley or Sacone. Sacone, get up. Get up, Sacone. Let's go. What a perfectly thrown ball. Yeah, one of the first ones today, in fact. Look at the blocking. Did they only rush, like, two guys? They rushed two, <laughs> they rushed two guys. <laughs> that might explain partially why I had so much time to throw. Look at this. What is this? Is Say really that open, or did his guy peel off when I threw it? Uh, he's really that open. Holy cow. Well, Say, I'll, I'll go ahead and say Say was the decoy there. So the kicker lines up for the PAT. Yeah, I could go for two, but I don't want to do that yet. I'm not about that life. I'm the go for two and you need to life. Dude, what a game. What a game. So yeah, Triple J, dude, if you're still here, I would just go watch the first half. Because this looks like it's somewhat in control. I'm up by two scores. The first half is insane. I mean, sorry to even spoil it, dude. You just got to. It was crazy, man. Ooh, he almost went around me there. Look at this. They do. The computer does a really good job of this. So I did my thing where I tried to stay wide and then cut in at the last moment. Ian Johnson, he saw it. He wouldn't have any of it. He tried to bounce it out. Like if he can, if he can uh, break a tackle there, he, he's he's running for a while. Yeah, because this guy's gonna turn around and block. This guy's probably gonna block. So yeah, he's he's got a ways to run if that's the case. So we're gonna stick with nickel. Okay, we're coming out wide. Ooh. Oh, okay, good, good, good. I. I I was hesitant. I think, did I switch on to someone? I was hesitant to switch because I don't know who they're going to give me, and I have to react so fast. So they gave me the guy behind that's probably okay. Yeah, I don't care for that because you just don't know who they're going to give you. And it's like, you can't, it's so hard. You, you don't really have time. 
just you don't have the reaction time to uh, figure out who who they're giving you. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, if he catches it and comes down in a stiff arm, that's a touchdown. It's true. All right, let's try this business again. Okay, we didn't do it. It's okay. They might be running. Look at that. Oh, he blocked right into me. Blocked, blocked me right into him. Good stuff, guys. Banks has been good, dude. He's been the ultimate shallow vulture over there. Number 18 takes it to 36. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. They moved the ball extremely well on their last possession on their way to the end zone. They'll take first down, over. 10 to go. Ball on the okay, let's try to grind some more clock. See if I can get some more consistent first downs. Have I converted a third down yet? I don't think I, but I haven't. 0 for 6. I mean, I would say I'd like to change that. That also means they were getting third downs, which I'd rather not be in, in third down. Yeah, that was good. Yeah, Banks, that's what, fourth or fifth pick of the year? That's, he's been balling out, out of control. Okay, let's get a lineman to move. There are the couple of moved there. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Gosh darn it. I tried to stay in the pocket. That's what I get for not video game drop backing. If I did my normal 20 yard video game drop back, I'm good to go. Well, fortunately, our D's been pretty stout so far. Hey, like I always say, I've gotten very, very lucky on, on fumbles this year. Really, the whole dynasty. I have not gone bitten by the fumble bug that badly. Get him. Nice. Nice job, Ben Jacobs. Now, I don't know if a hand, I mean, a handoff might, would have been better there, obviously. Uh, no, I was looking to, I was looking to see if somebody was open over the middle or hit the swing pass. Okay, let's try to rush in. There we go. Ooh, get her. Oh, no. Almost got there. Ooh, nice. Ben uh, Jacobs coming up. He's, cl he's cleaning up. Dude, I almost got there. How close was I to this tackle? Uh, I mean, within arm's reach, but no, no engagement. We'll stick with the cover three. It's all about the user, man. If I can get the user stuff going, we're good to go. So let's play Banks again. I'm gonna let CPU do it. Yes, good choice, good choice, Andy. I am man. <laughs> Here be roar. Oh, yeah, that's woman. Yeah, nice job. That's uh, Jenkins, right? Yeah, that's Jenkins. That's Mr. Jenkins. Leroy! Dude. Dude. Oh, man. All right, so here we go. We're going to see We're gonna see what we can see here. I'm going to try to hit Sacone coming come over the middle. Nope, we're going to uh, Clifton here. I was trying to get a block, dude. I was trying to get Sacone to block. I was trying to, like, kind of funnel him in there, but he didn't, he didn't take the bait. I couldn't, I couldn't bait Sacone into, into blocking outfield. I couldn't do it. Okay, we got him in the zone now. Let's, let's look at the swing pass. Let's look at the swing pass. Or potentially a handoff. Against a dime, the handoff looks pretty good too. So we'll read the left side here. Okay, they do fan out, so this doesn't look advantageous. But when they fan straight out, my, out, my fan can usually match their fan. So we'll read it. Looks good. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, we got the one ball. <gasps> we almost had it. We almost had it. We almost had the bowling ball. The hurdle would have completed the bowling ball. Look at this, dude, the stats. A lot of that is on the strength of game one. So look at this. The hurdle, He, if this hurdle is gets him through, he's gone. He, there's, a, there's a few too many guys there. Look, dude, he stepped on the guy's face. Look at this. Insult to injury. Just, uh, that actually, that's what, uh, that, that season when Ricky Williams came back to the Dolphins after he played in the CFL, that's, what, that's how, how his season ended on, like, his fifth carry. A guy stepped on his chest. Boom. Of course, he was on offense. Oh, he is, man. First and First down. Ball on the 26-yard line. 
I wouldn't. I, I'm not. I don't like games that are turnover fest because those usually don't bode well for me. Okay, we might have to hit Wiley on a streak. This one's for Jared or Sacone. No, nope, it's Sacone. Jump up. Yeah, Sacone. Let's go. Sacone's been big play. He's been big play today. He had position. Also, the the pass is leads him enough to where I can get the jump position that I need. Where I cut under. Is anybody else open? Not really. Clifton. That's a pick. These guys are gonna jump it. Nobody else is really open. Okay, yes. Uh, is this uh, Dorsey? No, that's, oh, that's Wiley. I just, I don't care for the streak as much. And he didn't have separation either. So let's look at flanker special. First down, 10 yards to go. On the 49 -yard line. So we're kind of looking at Sacone coming in. Actually, this is probably going to go to Dorsey if I can get good enough blocking. If blocking holds up, I'm finding Dorsey on the sideline. Let's go. Turn up field. We got this. We got this. Let's go, Dorsey. Move it out. Pretty good. Pretty good. Oh, man. I don't even mind that he came back 20 feet to get the pass. He was so open. Okay, we're going to try to hand it off here. This looks pretty good. Uh, not with that linebacker there. So this is my, oh, okay. It's yeah, it's the half. This is that's actually good because I may uh, they might come out in a different defense that's more advantageous. And they they do not. They do not. They're still in five two. Oh, pardon me. That is a four three. So we're basically reading that left defensive end to see if he gets blocked. He does. He does. Get in there. Get in there. Get in there. Oh my gosh. Of course. Of course I get the stiff arm. Of course I get Mutumboed at the inch line. I'm just glad I didn't fumble, though. Glad I didn't fumble. Okay, we'll run the same thing, different formation. Just try to keep the defense honest. See, that's those red zone stats, uh, James. That's why I do it, man. Okay, this, I'm going to try to dive up the middle. So we just want one of their linemen to move. Nobody's moving yet, so we'll do a three count. Oh, are you serious? I'm getting sat down at the one-inch line twice in a row. Okay. So we're do it. does the drags play have a, a swing pass? Not really. Let's get something with a swing pass. Is there a drag with a swing pass? There we go. I like this. So here, two options. I'm either shoehorning it into Sei, or I'm throwing a swing pass to Clifton. Probably Clifton. It's going to be. It's going to look pretty jumbled in there. No, nope. okay, so here we go, here we go. Get in, get in. Oh my gosh, he stepped out. Ugh, well, hey, uh, you know what? I don't, do I go for it here? I'm up by two scores. So I'm up by nine or I'm up by 12. I guess technically it is better to be up by nine. Go, uh, do the three, get the three. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. As soon as I did the math on nine versus 12, I'm like, yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting the, uh, I'm taking the three. Yeah, my math on that is if I'm up by nine, two touchdowns puts him up by five. If I'm up by 12, two touchdowns puts him up by two, where field goal wins. And with nine, you need a touchdown. So conservatism wins out. What a turnover fest. How many turnovers total in this game? After Is it like three? It's like three each, or maybe they even have four. I have two, they have three. Is it all picks? It's all picks. I bet mine are fumbles, right? Where was it? They're up here somewhere. Yep, two and two. All right, sticking with nickel. Full momentum now, no excuses. Yeah, Triple J must have gone back to watch the first half, so that's what I recommend. I wouldn't normally recommend not watching the stream, but... Oh, look at that. Look at the little speed burst. This is pure momentum right here. I normally, you're normally not going to get that, but I got that little speed burst. Oh, and actually he didn't even get there all the way. That's just a drop. All right. We'll take it. Okay, we'll sit on this. We're there. We got those. Okay, I think I'm going to try to jump the snap this time. 
and seven. It's third down and seven to go. All in their own 23. Got, oh, I got Oh, they're handing it off on third down. They don't want it. They don't want it. Boise doesn't want it. Down 12 with five minutes to go. Hand it off. Now, that's actually, as far as the computer logic goes, that's not a bad play. I am, I am in a pass defense. They just don't know how certain plays work and the fact that that play is not probably going to work. Ooh, we got another one. We might have another one. Not quiet. All right, so this is this is run run punt. It's run run punt time. Oh yikes! Well, maybe not. They're stacked over to the left. Uh, I was actually going to go to save, but I got hit. So how how did who how did I lose on blocking here? Oh, it's just the end, that end around guy. So did I not have enough blockers? Uh, wow, that actually would have been worse. I got lucky there that guy hit me because otherwise Dotman, Tadman is going to get me. Well, no, he got blocked at the last moment. That's okay. Clock runs. Only lost two yards. But see, that's the kind of silliness you can get away with with momentum. Uh, yeah, I guess I should have tried the shift there. I guess I was thinking pass. Uh, I was thinking pass. I was going to keep it. I should have. I should have tried to shift. I'll, I'll do it here. Actually, I could keep with Brandsader here. So let's do this. Let's, didn't they change their shift? They actually do change it a little bit. Let's just go down. We'll go down. Yeah. So did. Uh, oh, look at that. Just, I, so the, the, my I, I did shift left, and it actually worked. If I gave it to uh, Matthews there, he's probably getting tackled, but I can pitch it to Clifton. So that's NCAA for you. Can't win them all. Actually, let's try. Yeah, we'll go with PA Reed flow here. Third, Third down, six. Ball on the 41 yard line. Fan out. Okay, so we'll fan left and we'll look for the swing pass here. The bulldog. Come out the Haven't completed a third down yet. Ooh, get there. We got. Okay, we got one. We got a third down conversion. Oh, look at, look at uh, Brand Sanders rush yards. Minus 68. Wasn't it like minus 300 last year? Yeah, I agree. I just want to get in field goal range. Dude, here's the, I just wanted to call this to see what they came out in. They, they came out in another... Uh, okay, I'm going to block Clifton. I should be able to get Dorsey here. Oh, he got... Okay, well... We'll start to run. We'll bleed more clock. PA all across. That doesn't look like a read. Actually, let's do... Let's Wait, why is that... Why does Clifton appear to be not dot there? Let's run this PA all across, though. And we'll try to get a swing pass to Clifton. So Clifton's on the L. Okay, we'll fan left. Lines up with four wide outs. Oh, there we go. We get a juke. Got a juke. Okay, third and short. Uh, let's see. Do we have any kind of swing pass in this formation? Oh, let's go PA Reed. Yeah, we'll probably look to hand off. It's, I think it's a similar deal here, deal here. It's hand off. Well, yeah, it's looking swing pass now. Oh no! Oh, saves wide open. Oh no! Woo! Okay, here's what I saw. <laughs> I see Say wide open, so I just wait so long to throw it. I didn't realize. I just didn't see this guy in my peripheral. I mean, he kind of blends into the end zone a little bit, but that's definitely my bad. I just saw Say with nobody around him. This could have been a pick easily. Yeah, it's the first. Yeah, I could have scrambled right. Uh, yeah, kind of. This guy's coming up. But is oh for first down yeah it was like a yard I would I would have gotten it so let's go to Lanier. Oh, uh yeah let's go well now let's go we'll go with Matthews I guess HP sub PA Reed 
Here are the offensive production stats. Oh, look at this. We're almost going to get our uh, 400 yards. If we get the ball back, we may. They line up in the gun, looking to spread out this defense a bit. Let's go. Let's go. Well, Clifton is tired. But I agree. Yeah, it's might as well go with our next best. That's that's Ryan Matthews. What a game this has been. So the kicker lines up for the PAT. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. They line up to kick this one away. Wow. And he got all of this one. Everybody watching this game, you're, yeah, it's, as Jared said, this is full spectrum NCAA. I just still can't believe it. I think it might have been. I mean, it looked like a classic turnover, turnover fest drubbing early on. Outside of that first play, which I, even at the time, like I said, oh, 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 okay, we went for the pick. We got greedy. It's okay. We got the tackle. Um, even at the time, like uh, before I even crossed the end zone, I was thinking, dude, we're not getting momentum for this, though. And, of course, you're not going to turn your nose up at a touchdown, but uh, we'll do some. We'll go back here. Uh, that's That matters so much. It's got to be pretty good. Okay, they showed it for a second there, but I advanced past it too quickly. Um 23. Is that does that get the uh, does that get the J the coach James seal of approval? 20, 23 yards, 23 yards in the air. I mean, really, my offense, my defense has been incredible. It's been turnovers of have, have how it's how they've gotten their uh, their scores. They have rushed it for quite a bit. Does it doesn't Ian Johnson have one really long run though? He has a 65. So outside of the 65, he's 23 for 90. So he actually has still had a pretty good day. Hey now, no, dude. Well, are you? If that's a reverse jinx, I'm okay with that. The defense is in the nickel. He steps up, looking. Roberts will make the sack. Roberts dropping him. What happens when the protection breaks down up front? Yeah, but coach, I think the quarterback has to release the ball. Yeah, they're going for it as they should. So they're going to go. Okay, I'm going to try to jump the snap. I'm going to assume they're going to snap it right away as well. The Broncos line up with three wide. Oh, I didn't get a. I didn't get the blowback. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Whenever you have that much time to throw against cover three, the CPU is going to make you pay. We'll go cover three. Cover three dime. Oh my gosh, he tackled Dean Johnson. Whatever, it's okay, it's okay. Let's throw it and hurry up so I can game it here. you can gain solid yardage, you're doing something right. Boise State sets up in the eye. He passes. Look at the warp on that. <laughs> yeah, this is, we're, don't forget guys, well, I'm up by a lot, but this is still NCAA Heisman. This is still NCAA Heisman. Seven yard gain. How about the poise of this quarterback to locate his receiver, pass the sticks, and get in the ball? That was a great throw. All right, we can go for a bait here. So Cone's out there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's let's, let's give my guys a rest. My DBs are so tired. Okay, thank goodness. First <laughs> down. Remember, dude, that's how they coach it up. That's how the coaches teach him. That's out of bounds. We don't want to be a part of that. It falls incomplete. Child was the As I've mentioned before, if you go for a pass that's out of bounds and bat it back in bounds, it's fair game. Look at Clifton. Ian Johnson did pretty well against me. I gotta gotta give him his due. We're there, we're there, we're there. Okay. Okay, we'll go back to dime here. Oh, okay. I will go to cover three. I, the the different formation screwed me up. So now we're in like a four three cover three or something. That's okay. Old man up over here. Number 10, back in the gun. Stepping up. Throws it deep down. We'll go for the OPI. Oh, they didn't call it. They didn't call it. Thank goodness. I stopped at the last moment. So how did this not work? I just didn't get a good animation. I got a, Is that the bunny hop? With So it's not a real catch animation? 
Okay, we'll go dime. Yeah, we'll go dime, and that way, if they get in a hurry up, we'll uh, one for two. Or yeah, I don't think I've gone for it on fourth that many times this season. I'll try to jump it. Fresno State lines up in a dime defense here. Here we go. Looking. Oh, almost got there. Okay, that's a bat down. That's a bat down. Woo hoo! Jordy picking it. Getting greedy because we uh, would have gained yardage by him not picking it. All right, so here we're just going to put in Lanier, run it a couple times, and call it good. They have timeouts, so they might call timeouts. From their own 14 yard line, take over first down. The Bulldogs. And if I get past the first down, I'm not running for a touchdown. I'm just. Okay, they're shifting though. Oh. Tried for the manual counter. How close am I to 400 yards? Uh, 383. Yeah, I'm probably not going to get that. That's okay. So let's do tight end slot. Uh, QB slot option. Yeah, I tried to. We did our darndest. Okay, they're fanned out, so we'll fan out as well. Get Bear up in the other ha halfback position. That'll do it. They don't call timeout, so it won't endanger my third down stats any further. Good game. What a game, man. This is insane. This is this is this is the kind of game that my honestly my my game plan is designed to is designed to give me a chance to win in because you just want to stay the course. When your guys are fumbling, they're not blocking, they're not tackling. The other team's getting free touchdowns. You got to stay the course because you can make plays on D. And that's really what got us back in it. They fumbled. They turned it over back to us. Dude, right? Oh, James, that's a good call, man. That is a great call. For a few reasons. If you're, uh, you know, if you're a skill player, like, okay, I wouldn't fumble the ball like that. I got a chance. Wowzers. Wowzers. What what a day. What a day this was. 12 for 20, one touchdown. That's pretty good for Brand Sater. Can't be too upset. 8.3 yards average. Eight, eight's not bad. We'll take eight. Ten is, like I said, ten is ideal. Ten plus is amazing. Clifton turned him up. Got that long one. So outside of that long one, 75 yards, he's still uh, 17 for like 80. Yeah I, yeah, I don't think I was completing anything early on. I think you're right. I don't think there's like a play-by-play -play on here, but yeah, exactly, exactly. Uh, Matthews did a little work too, 38 yard long, so he he got he got a big play there. Clifton keeping it going with the uh, leading receiver on the team. Sacone with a couple of big ones. We really spread it around quite well. I'm enjoying this this spread around type type of offense. It's more fun this way. As much as I love Paul Williams. And also, I think my offense would have been a lot better last year. I could have done a similar deal. Because, shoot, I had Joe... For I still could have spread around last year because I had Joe Fernandez, Jerron Fairman. Jerron Fairman is... I think he's better than anyone I have now, my receiver. He was like an 80 or a 78. And my best now, I think, is Chaston. Who is a... Uh, let's see, can I see the depth chart? What is Chaston? He's an 82. Okay. So, basically, my slot... My third receiver last year was as good as my best receiver now. So... He, yeah, yeah. If, I mean, if if uh, if I'd have run this kind of offense last year, I could have really been off the charts. I was just too focused on getting it to Paul Williams, and I ran that uh, that receiver sweep way too much. Wiley with almost four yards per. Yeah, you know, I guess how many returns did he have? He probably didn't have that many. Three with a long of eighty-two. I mean, what was their punt average? Yeah, so they averaged two net yards per punt. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. What about their punt return? I do pretty good on punt coverage. Net punt, it's almost negative. It's two yards. Yeah, they, that's that's comedy. That's comedy. Yeah, this is nice. 
Michael Popovich with the uh, the pancakes. Look at this guy setting guys down. <laughs> right? They should have just gone for it every time if you're only going to get two yards. Uh, Ging, that's a heck of a name there. So who do we have? Edwards. Edwards has been big, man. Clutch tackles. Banks with the pick. Did we score on defense? I guess we didn't. Three tackles for loss. That's just a nice vulture job playing up on the uh, playing up close to the line in that shallow zone. It really was, man. It really was. I mean, this rivals the first half at least rivals uh, the Washington game. It really does. We didn't put him in the game. We could. He's a he was a tackle if I remember right. We we could because there are actually two tackles. One we could have made it. I think Devin Cunningham and then Kenny Wiggins. I actually might have put Cunningham in here. I can't remember. So yeah, let's 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 continue on and look at our uh, look at our recruiting. Wiggins was it the guard? It might have been uh, Che Guevara that I put in. Let's have a look. Yeah, I'm blanking. Let's look at recruits first, though. Well, no, we haven't advanced yet. Let's look at we'll look at this. We'll do th things one at a time. Let's look at our roster. Then we'll look at recruits. Keep in mind we have not advanced the week. We still have to advance the week. Okay. Pacheco. Uh, no, no. Wesley Cooper. That's the guy I put in. So we did not put in. We don't even have really any. We don't have any freshman tackles. We have a couple freshman guards, though. But this guy's not that good. I mean, he might get cut. This guy could easily get cut. That's why I went for more O-line this during season recruiting, because my O-line prospects are not that good. Let's see. Bama. Bama actually starts off with high interest, I think, in this game. Because at this point, they weren't that far off of their big-time sanctions. What about, like, USC? So other teams have uh, have some issues, I guess. USC only medium interest. I don't know if the reali realism is that good. Okay. Yeah. So I I just I don't think we didn't we didn't get any tackle recruits, unfortunately. I don't think there's even a redshirt freshman. I think everybody is. I think the youngest is a redshirt sophomore. Let's look at the recruits. Who do we get? Who did we get? We'll check on that though, James. We'll check. Oh, come on, yes. Let's go, man. Look at this. Got our halfback. Got our center. The O line is looking to get short up. That is nice. That's really nice. Perfect fit. Jumped at the offer. So that's a uh, coaching style. Program Prestige. Oh, maybe it's Program Prestige because this guy has a plus. He has the same message and it's Program Prestige. Prestige had little to do with it, so this might have been a coaching style. Nice. Yeah, that's an excellent haul. That's excellent. I mean, the, the center and the tackle, I needed I needed O lineman worse than I needed the halfback. So, I mean, let's look at those tackles again, though. Yeah. Here, Meeks is the youngest, redshirt sophomore. I think we only had the three visits, so I think they all signed. Let's see if we lost anyone else. Scott, I, I, I think those are the only ones we lost. I think the only guy we lost that we were going after, I think was this guy. Because these two, I think we didn't give any... No, Scott, we were recruiting early. He went. He had interest in USC. So I think we were, we were recruiting that guy. But we've got, pretty much got everybody that we're going after. Is that what it says? Oh, let's look at that. <laughs> this is the uh, the Desolation Bowl. Who lives in a more remote area? Arizona State, USC. They must play each other, right? Utah. Oh, did UNLV lose? UNLV lost. They lost to TCU. However, we did not jump them. We're going to need some help to get that January bowl game, guys. We're going to need some major help. Do we have bowl projections? Not yet. 
We'll get those points. Don't don't worry, <laughs> Carpinteria. Dan, don't worry about the point. We'll get to the we'll get to the recruiting. I just want to check. I want to check the uh, the the award updates. Yeah, we're not gonna get anybody on here. Yeah, Jenkins still going strongly. Groza, Stitzer with the Groza. Wiley with the return. I think, uh, I don't think he was number one before. Two punt return touchdowns, averaging 16 yards. That's so good. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, if we, uh, there's the coach. I don't know. If we, uh, we'll see who we get next year. I'm also not hell bent on making every recruit into a real every every real Fresno recruit into someone on here. I just want it if, if they're impact and a fit. You know, I don't necessarily want like random low down guy like regular guys. Like for example, I think I could have put I think I could have put one of the safeties as Marvin Haynes. I was like, ah, Haynes is good. Haynes is pretty good, but I'm like he. I, I kind of like having just maybe f six or seven. Basically, whoever the impact guys are, because I kind of like also having like I, 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 I still get attached to the to the no name guys like Edwards. Dude, Edwards is good. I mean, I'm already kind of attached to this guy. I like him, even though he's a random CPU generated. Like I get attached to these just the computer guys. So I don't know. I guess I feel like taking one of these guys and naming them someone on Fresno that's not necessarily impact or a fit doesn't really add a lot whereas I feel like somebody like Ben Jacobs picture perfect fit and impact so that adds a lot same with uh, other guys too like Wiley Wiley actually is probably a little better as a receiver in this game than he was in real life but uh, but guys like that those are a fit so I feel like that yeah you know, that's that's a good point you no know, that's a really good point uh, he did make the NFL yeah and I would have done that I, I would have made Wiggins if I got a, t a tackle I was looking at that but I just happened to not get anyone unfortunately I mean shoot I wanted to get somebody to come in as uh, as Ryan Matthews but that didn't happen but we got super lucky about that Andrew Jones guy all right so let's distribute those points oh we should have visits coming up actually yeah look at this we have some visits Battle Mountain, Nevada. Another tackle. This would be huge. This would be huge. He's very impressed with our academic standings. So we will do, yeah, we'll go Sac State and we will go, oh, actually, look at this. We only have one home game left. So we need, we need to get guys in this week if we can. So that first guy, we're going to miss out on a uh, visit, unfortunately. Terrell Rogers. Well, he's, his number one is Arizona State. So that might be hard. It might be hard to land this guy. And USC. USC is also ranked higher than us. Should I give this guy more points to try to keep him or try to try to stay stay up top? I don't know. Also, if his visit is uh, if he's visiting SC or, or Arizona State, he might commit to them. I wouldn't be surprised. We can. We know you can bring him in during a buy. You totally can. It just doesn't work as well. I don't think. But you can get him on a visit. But it would have to be next week. So this guy, I guess, hasn't trimmed his list yet. See, these guys that want visits, they've trimmed their list. So next week when this guy trims his list, we have to hope that he has the next week available. I think that's the best we can hope for. So academics. This guy, let's see. No playing time, no academics, no location. USC, UNLV. This could be program prestige. I might stick with program prestige. UNLV is pretty good, so that could be program prestige. This gentleman, Sacramento State. Very excited about the opportunity to play for a coach like you. So that is coach prestige, so that makes it easy. Defensive tackle. No location, no coach prestige, no program prestige. Fresno State, Arizona State, USC. I might go coach style because my defensive stats are very good. So there we go. Yeah, so we can bring him in on the bye, but what I suspect is, I suspect that he could be visiting Arizona State or SC. No, because he's not doing any visits yet. I mean, I, I kind of want to just give this guy like 30 points and hope that we can maybe try to jump Arizona. Arizona State, pardon me. So let's get these guys all up to at least 20. Oh, we must have another guy. No, too many points. Yeah. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, you're right. I should get my pick of the week. Let's go down a couple so I can get these guys to at least 20. 
Also, corner isn't... Actually, corner... I mean, corner's not a huge need. Is it? One freshman, two sophomores. Well, actually, I do kind of need because... Oh, I really do need, actually. And he's going to play. No, no, I do need I do need corners because, yeah, my number one corner is, is Banks. After that, it's like Damon Owens and A.J. Jefferson. They're both in the 60s. They're not good. So literally, my number one corner next year is is Banks. So we might actually go like 18 on these guys. Yeah, we'll go 30, we'll go 16 on this D-tackle. Because I do need D-tackles as well, actually. I have one D-tackle that's okay, young, but after that, nobody. Look at the tackles, man. Like, it'd be so nice if I could land these guys, because I could also move them around to tackle, guard, things like that. Center, I can move them around how I need to. Which actually, when, when I get around to recruiting, I need you guys to remind me to move around O-linemen to different positions and even it out. I should have done that last year. I could have put one of my guards at tackle and had a young tackle coming in. So that would be important. Oh, okay, yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, I could even go like 15. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Or at least, yeah, how about the guys that we know their pitch? Let's lower them. Okay, that guy we don't. We'll leave him. We'll just mark him by going up to 18. This guy we know. This guy we don't know. This guy I think we know. Why did we go down, I wonder, last year, last week? Maybe it's relative to Arizona State because it says he had a good unofficial visit to Arizona State. Yeah, let's let's do that. Uh, oh, wait, I was going to lower the guys that we know. Oh, no, the guys we don't know. That's right. So this guy we know, this guy... I thought we knew a couple of them. Did I mix that up? I mixed that up. Yeah, I was going to leave this guy at 15. Leave that guy higher. Leave that guy lower. Leave that guy higher. There we go. Yeah, yeah, my bad. I, that, I think I have it right now, though. So, I mean, I think that looks pretty good. Yeah. Cool. I appreciate it. Among other things, among other things, James is my recruiting coordinator. So next week, this is the one I kind of do. I know. Don't lose Zach State. And I was about to cover that. I, uh, I, I, I kind of wish I had scheduled somebody else. Just schedule like Toledo or something like that. I really should have. I just, I was going for realism, but I think in the future, I'm not going to schedule these FCS teams. We're climbing up, man. Total defense, 14. I like that much better. I like... I don't want my total defense to be number one, because I'm definitely not number one. Did my mic just pop? No, I think my voice is kind of loud. Sorry, guys, if it's too loud. Yeah, it's very balanced, 15 and 14. I mean, it's... My offense really rolls, and it makes sense, because I have some good skill, some good skill players, and I'm not going against that high of competition. So it checks out. Look at that. 21 to 7. Just picked it up after that. That was what a game. I'm going to have to rewatch that first half, man. That was insane. That was so insane. I think that's going to do it for the video, you guys. Thanks for watching. What a game. I mean, if you tuned into this one, you got a good one. So next week, Sac State will be a little easier. But like I say, hey, it, you know, whatever the matchup is, whether you're bad against good, good against bad, even, they're all fun. So. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, man. Yeah, it was. Yeah, 33 zip. So thanks, guys, for tuning in. And also thanks to Triple J for stopping in. It looks like he probably took my advice and went to go look at the first half because we didn't hear back from him. That's okay. Because that's the one to check out, that first half. Oh, my gosh. And the second half, too. I mean, that's where we kept the momentum going, got a couple scores, got going, got ahead. But the first half was some madness. So, so good stuff. So that'll do it for the video. And we'll be back next time with Sac State as Season 2 rolls on in the Fresno State Coronavirus Dynasty. See you then, guys.